Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to solder a QFP44 package on the third PCB. Well, first, well you have to prevent uh, unwanted solder with Captain tape. Uh, apply the heat resistant uh, Captain tape uh, on the areas that you don't want to apply solder then stick your uh, QFP, QFP uh, package and double check the direction of pin number one uh, I have the uh, pin number one here and you can find the uh, place where the pin number one should be placed uh, adjust the position okay got it okay uh, when you uh, fix the the MCU with the captain tape don't apply the captain tape horizontally because if you uh, uh, apply the tape horizontally the tape will uh, uh, stick on the on these two captain tapes and it will uh, tear them off when you uh, uh, remove this this tape on the MCU now uh, And now it's time to apply uh, flux. Uh, I, I recommend you to use uh, good flux. Uh, as, as for me, I use uh, flux for uh, BGA rework, a gel type uh, flux. Okay here and here okay uh, now I'm gonna t turn on the uh, smoke absorber so there will be some noise Apply your solder with your uh, solder tip. Uh, after you solder the uh, two rows, check whether there uh, is any breaching or not. Uh, a magnifier or a looper will help it. Okay. I, have a, I have some bridges here. Add flux again. Okay, cool. And now remove the captain tape and the MCU. And uh, 
then uh, I think I need a new tape to stick here. I don't want to solder. Uh, I want to. I don't want to solder here. So I will cover the area with an additional captain tape. Okay. Good. Now add more flux. solder again Okay, it's done for the MCU. Now the other uh, SMD parts are easy to solder. So the, the video manual for soldering QFP package is uh, complete. So uh, if you follow these steps, you will be able to easily uh, solder your QFP, QFP uh, package. Okay, thank you. See you again.